Another mission here. Fish Finder 360 Small Catch Focusing. Get ready to calibrate the special Fish Finder 360 by catching fish that weigh no more than 11 pounds. This is necessary for improving the sensitivity of Fish Finding Finder 360 so it's accurately detect and display smaller fish species. Completing this and subsequent missions will reward you with a top tier Fish Finder 360 on both the tablet and the rental boat. Hmm. That'll give me 11,200 XP, a bait coin, and 55,000 of the in-game cash. We'll go ahead and track that. It says, stay on the boat and catch a specified number of fish weighing no more than 11 pounds. So we need to go back to the boat here. It's a nice little island. <laughs> Let's see. Now, see, the rental boat, I believe, is right over here. Which I have no need to do, but... I believe you can go down there and rent that. There's the dude. Yep, he's just going to say the same thing. Catch fish of different weights to calibrate the fish finder. And yeah, the cats didn't come back. Yeah, this is the rental boat right here, I believe. No, nope, maybe not. Well, that's interesting. I thought you could rent some of these boats. Let's get on our boat here. Alright, is there a specific place we need to go? To switch to Echo Sounder or Fish Finder 360, use F. Yeah, it's not looking like I need to do anything special. I just need to... Find a spot to fish and go there. Well, let's get out of our port here. It might be might be better to just we'll go over here to this navigation but we can see what we see. Ah shoot. Thirty three thirty minutes fifty one seconds before I can get there too much fast traveling. But yeah, I'm picking up something on the miner there. Well, we'll just pull it out anyway. I'd rather save the cash and just... take our time going through here and see if we see anything on the fish finder.
See, I'm seeing some fish down there. Now this is where we're going to be using the much lighter gear. I don't think it said anything as far as... Hold on, let me take a look here. Yeah, it doesn't say what type of gear we need to use, so we can use bottom rods just as easy as we could. Lure casting. See, there's a lot of birds here, that's why I'm kind of wondering. We haven't really fished close to shore. Let's see what happens. Let's see, we've got... We could use these sea worms. We've got three different rods for that, so we can... Easily cast that out and see if we can't get something. Seriously? <laughs> Already getting a bite? I think I'm going to try a float rod, too, here. Nothing that big. Yeah, these finger mullets might be good. And that weigh more than 11 pounds. Now, if we don't do anything here, I do have a good spot. And once we have that cool down period end, I'm going to jump there because I would imagine it doesn't matter what kind of fish. I think even the squid will probably count. And I've got a great spot for them. And they do not weigh more than 11 pounds. Okay, we're getting a bite. Now we were. Yeah, let's go ahead and reel these in, but I think I am going to put smaller hooks on these. Two up might still be too big. All right, let's go ahead and let me see here. See, this is what I'm talking about. Definitely are seeing smaller fish here. Seems to be working just fine. I think we just need smaller hooks. What's the peak here? Well, we're in the peak. Yeah, let's try a smaller hook. 
Good God, no wonder. I thought that was a two lot. It's a five lot. <laughs> All right, let's put a smaller hook on there. I'm gonna go with a. Let's see, got number two. Uh, 10 might be a little too small. Let's go with the number 2. Okay. We'll use this one because that is a lighter rod also. These are a lot more sensitive, so we should have no problem. But they're definitely there. What? Oh. Yeah, I might just throw a one on there just in case. Now the anchovies did they go for? Because like I said, I'm seeing some pretty small fish here. Sea worms, natural eggs. Okay, let's try natural eggs. I think I do have some in here. And spawn sacks. I'll try that. which one it is. I think it's this one. Yep, it is. And I think we got our first fish here, guys. Yep, trophy Japanese mackerel. There's the first one. the hook size on this. Number 10 seemed a little small to me. Okay, we're getting a bite. I'm just not sure. Okay, I got it. It's this one. Yep, I think we got our second one, and it is the Japanese anchovy. Yeah, changing the hook size to number two definitely made the difference. So it needs to be a pretty small hook. A little later. Alright guys, I am back. I did go off screen for a little bit because I thought it was going to catch a while, take a while to catch these, but it turns out that it doesn't. I've only been here maybe about eh, 12 to 15 minutes and I've caught all but one. I've just got one more to get. 
and for the past few minutes it's been a bit of a lull but I wanted to go ahead and come back because I'm contemplating going over to another spot to see if I can't catch a big fin reef squid to see if they count of course the uh, jack mackerel and the anchovies are also there too so I just need one more but yeah, definitely work with the sea worms in the number two hooks. That seems to work best. And they just keep coming and keep coming. So it really is not a bad mission. This is actually one of the fastest ones I've done so far. So hopefully we're going to get this last one. All right, the lull continues. Yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and reel these in and go over to that other spot where the big fin reef squid are located. Yeah, it was like boom, 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 and then just kind of quit, so. Now, I did take a look at the sonar, and I'm not seeing anything on the sonar, so I don't know if that means they moved on, or I'm in a dead zone, or what. But let me see here. Yeah, I'm going to be taking you over there, but as you can see on the Echo Sounder Fish Finder 360, I'm not seeing anything, so... Yeah, let's go down here to this other spot. Doesn't hurt to mix things up a little bit. Alright. Definitely a good spot for Jack Mackerel. And let me see. I'm trying to figure out. I know they don't go for the sea worms, so we're going to see if they won't go for something else. Yeah, they will definitely go for these. put an anchovy on there. Now since I have such little hooks I shouldn't get anything very big even by accident. At least I hope I don't. Yeah, because this gear is not going to hold something big. But it'd be cool to get see if that uh, squid counts. This is where I caught him, right at that marker. I have yet to get a unique one, though. I've still got to get that. I've got plenty of young, plenty of common, and a few trophies. We'll just sit here and see if anything, anything goes for it. But there we go. Something's already biting. I'm trying to figure out which one it is, though. Sometimes it's hard to tell with all the waves and stuff. No, it's not that one. Let's try this one. It's gotta be this one. Yep, there it is. I don't think... Well, that could be... No. It is a Japanese jack mackerel. Well, shoot. I wanted to see if it would it would count with the other, but there we go. We did accomplish the mission. Fish Finder 360, small catch focusing. We got a strike time down on us. But 11,200 cash, a bait coin, a 5,500. No, it's 5,500 cash, 12,500 12, XP. Now the next one is the Fish Finder 360 mid-size calibration. Prepare for another Fish Finder 360 calibration by targeting fish the way between 44 and 132.3. That's going to be tough. That's going to be tough. Well, we only have to get 7 of them, though. We don't have to get 15. Well, we're going to have to change up our gear a bit, guys. But, yeah, this is going to be a little bit tr tricky. 
And in all reality, though, this is probably a good spot to catch them. But this stuff here we've got is not going to hold up. We're going to need to pull this in. And I'm probably going to have to use my heavy sea rods to make this work. Alright guys, well, we'll move on with the next mission as soon as we can here. I'm going to take a look here at the sonar. Looks like we got plenty of here to work with. Well, let me go ahead and get everything set up. And we'll take care of this.